experiment you could try at home. You're going to need a 9 volt battery, you're going to need a couple alligator leads, you're going to need some water, some baking soda, pennies, aluminum foil, and some paper towel. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to hook up one end of our battery, the negative terminal, to the aluminum foil. And then we're going to take our paper towel and we're going to dunk it in the water. And we're going to add some baking soda to it. Alright, and then from there, we're going to take the other end and we're going to attach it to a penny. So we're going to go ahead and pick one of our pennies here. So I've got a few different ones. I want to start with one that is shiny. That one's pretty good. Put that face down on there. And we're going to take this lead and just press it right on top. So if you listen carefully, you might be able to hear a little bit of crinkling, and that's actually some CO2 forming and bubbling from underneath. And even though we've only been doing this for a little bit of time, we can go ahead and remove this, and we'll find that there's a green substance forming. And that green substance is actually a mixture of copper-containing compounds. And sometimes we can get the image of Abe Lincoln to actually appear in here if we do this well. Let's see if we can try this again with a different penny. Uh, this time let's try one that's a little less clean. And this time we'll try it on the other side. A little bit of water here. a little bit of outline there. So I'm going to go ahead and add a little more water now and see if we can get this run a little better. We'll do a little bit of high speed to kind of speed up the film here. So this is a fun experiment you could try at home and you can do all kinds of things to change up. Like you can switch out how much baking soda, how much water, you can try doing different types of batteries, we can try doing um, multiple batteries at once, 